Indian obviously built this bike as a tribute to yesteryear, evidenced by the sexy sweep of the balanced fenders used since the 1940s, iconic tank emblems and front fender figurehead. Large 46mm forks float the front end on 4.7 inches of travel, and the single rear pneumatic shock can be adjusted for load or preference with 4.49 inches of travel, which can be considered adequate, at best. Suspension components with variable tuning capabilities are becoming more ubiquitous every year, and anyone not yet looking at such features is surely falling behind. Wink Nudge, Indian. Dual four-paw calipers bind the front brake discs, and a twin-paw caliper binds the rear disc. Indian didn't skimp on the rear brakes either. They put 300mm discs all the way around for plenty of stopping power, and the brakes at both ends of the bike also benefit from an anti-lock brake system. The calipers disappear behind painted to match brake covers that blend right in with the fenders. MSRP for 2018 falls in at $21,499 for the Chieftain and $23,999 for the Chieftain Dark Horse. Available this year only in grey or grey, steel grey for the Chieftain and thunder black smoke for the Dark Horse. There are no nice two tones or color options to be had, 